morning welcome back to my den uh, we're gonna have another shave today brought to us this time by strike gold shave Rushmore I don't know why it was sitting on the table there ready to go so that's what we're doing we got the matching aftershave we're lathering with the uh, Omega uh, bore nice and Floppy. This is one of my early brushes. Like it a lot. Like it a lot, lot, lot. This is a. Uh, I'm gonna be using the Feather Batman. This is the black one. And I see here that I didn't mic up. So let's see if we can't make it sound a little better for. Sound a little better. I didn't even. I got such so excited to do this that I didn't even wet my face down or anything. Oh, flush a little water on. Did get the little lather going. It's a little kind of a low lather. It's disappearing. I don't think I have enough product. Look at that, just kind of fizzling out. Maybe I broke it. Well, it won't be good enough to start with, but I'm going to go back to the back to the tub. I didn't bloom the the puck this time, just see what happens if I don't bl bloom it and it looks like not blooming it's not a good idea okay it's got a little bit more soap on here mix it with the what I got see how it does oh, look at that Oh, I guess we weren't too far off. I don't remember why I don't use this very much. It's just, I ran, kind of ran out of room in the cabinet back here. If you can see. Uh, well, there's some room here on this shelf. For more soaps but then i don't have much room for fragrances up here so we'll have to do a little sorting mama and i've been threatening to do that with so many wonderful soaps in the pipe uh i'll have to make some room This is the, uh, the same uh, blade that I had in Bullwinkle the other day. That's what I've named my Occam's razor. And it's got these great huge ears hanging off. Like Bullwinkle the Moose. I 
Then I'll have to kind of go along with Barbara Dave in some ways that using this is not quite like using a, a straight, pretty close, with the little bumpies there kind of mitigate a lot of the danger of using an actual open blade, which is okay by me. I don't want to damage such a pretty face. <laughs> Crack myself up. Well, it's Friday. We made it through successfully another week. We had an excellent cold front come through. Skies cleared up. Sun shining. I go out in the garage and fire up the car and take a little run. Decide which direction we'll go. Because we didn't get a lot of blowing or anything. So most of the leaves are still on the trees, so we're getting some good color on the uh, autumn leaves. And it's going to be a pretty nice day. So I'll retrace a route that I used to take my son on when I had a scooter. He would sit on the seat in front of me. I had, it was an old Honda Elite 150. It's a 150cc water-cooled motor scooter. He must have been five or six. So it's been a few years. One of my favorite memories, though. He would sit on the front of the saddle behind the windscreen it had a fairly tall windscreen some would say it was kind of a full dresser because it had a tall windscreen it had uh, a radio that dude was optioned out and it would do Oh, 50, maybe 55 on the little 10-inch wheels. Didn't want to go much faster than that. Not so much that uh, the uh, you were afraid that the bike was going to screw up, but those little tires were uh, they were whirring, and so. Uh, Just out of safety concern, didn't take it much past 50. I bet you I could have got to 60, but never did. Never tried. Little motor just kind of ran out of power. I think it only had 20 horsepower. But uh, he, uh, we uh, went south of the old National Road, which is south of us here. US 40 and uh, we ran into a bunch of uh, Arleys I guess they were doing a poker run and the sight of me on my scooter and the lad in front of us they they thought that was just great so they let us join up with them and we ran with them for a little while but they had to keep slowing down because I couldn't keep up Finally, I just let him go. I said, yeah, I waved him on. 
but it was kind of fun. But uh, you can't take yourself too seriously. Life in general, and if you're going to drive a scooter in traffic, you can't take yourself terribly serious. And then on the way home, the boy fell asleep, slumped over on one of my arms, and conked out right there on the scooter. Made it a little tricky, but we made it home okay. This is turning out pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. I haven't thought about that old scooter for a while. They're still available. They stopped making that particular model a long time ago. They've been making the other models though, which are just as nice. Well, let's see how we did here. I'm, I'm sure I didn't have any problem, but we'll do the alum thing. Just the basic tangle of everybody getting removed and uh, well there's lemon I swear, Dave, I signed in. I saved. I designed a Thayer's Lemon t-shirt for my friend Nurse Dave. I went back onto my, signed back onto my Zazzle account and couldn't find it on me. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me more about it. Uh-huh. Oh, does that mean old Buster just does he teasing you? Yeah. Yeah, he won't attention is what it is. And she'll she'll keep that up until uh, I give her attention. Yeah. Oh, bow. Get the Nivea two and one. This is a total tribute to Dave because I was thinking about his trying to recreate that t-shirt. figured out how to get my artwork back up on the on the t-shirt. I did that last night. So I'll clean the brush a little bit here while we're waiting on that to dry. This uh, two and one's good stuff. If I had any damage to my hole plating, it's to take care of it. Almost as well as Spike. I'm not sure which I like better. Huh? That's what you wanted. Come on. She likes to get up in the window. That's good enough for another helping. It's got quite a quite a reducer. 
uh, you have to kind of work, you have to really want it. I'm not sure what it smells like. It smells nice though. Kind of a, I guess it would be sort of a barbershoppy scent. And that would have been from the Black Hills Gold or Strike, Strike Gold Shave Mount Rushmore. Uh, and their aftershave it smells just wonderful. We uh, bristled everything with the Omega Bore Long Bristle. This thing's got to have, I don't know, 35, 40 millimeters of loft. And we use the uh, uh, Feather. Uh, Artist Club SS I named Batman That's all we have for today. I'm happy that you came to join me glad to have a shave in the morning I'm kind of usually an afternoon shaver, but today the morning sounds best. I'm Major Rich and you will find me on shavingcadre.com You're always welcome to come join us there. We have a Wonderful time and a great bunch of guys. We have Zoom calls, we play games, bingo, and several other uh, games that we'll play on when we're doing Zoom calls, which is great fun too. And uh, Christmas is coming up. We have a card exchange and try to share our brotherhood through the with people we've never met but we're great friends and that's kind of something special uh, so if you like come join us and uh, we will see you hopefully for the next shave bye bye